How's it going everyone? What you're going to see today is, well in the video at least, you'll see uh, a pretty frantic ending to Caspian Border Rush Defense. Uh, where I use the tank and the ACWR for the most part to hold off a lot of the oncoming rush attackers. Um, but this video itself wasn't the most entertaining. The score in it was pretty good. Like I finished I think 33 and 5. But with the, the other, because they stole our jet, uh, with the continual, you know, bombardment of them continually hitting us and disabling our tanks, uh, pushing us back, we push back, uh, and, but there were long breaks in between, like minute or two breaks between uh, the waves of rushes. It wasn't the most entertaining to watch. But the ending when I replayed it back was pretty good. And I figured, hey, this is, you know, this is okay. It's not the best, but it's fine. Uh, I figured it would be perfect as like a sort of three minute video to give a quick, intro uh, a quick uh, channel update on some new things. Uh, and I'll get to it. Well, first I'll explain really quick about the tank. Of course, if you've seen my tank video breakdown before, and thank god I had these engineers repairing me otherwise I would have been done because I never get engineers repair me in videos for the most part um, but I do use reactive armor uh, and that was basically the saving grace because I was getting hit by jets, I was getting hit by choppers RPGs, a tank coming up soon enough but anyway enjoy the rest of the, the, the video footage of this frantic little ending here but I will, I will talk about the quick channel updates first one first being that I have Twitter now uh, there will be a link in the video description and there will be a link next to my battle log on my main page if you want to check it. That being said, uh, I probably won't be using my Twitter an awful lot other than to post th when I upload a video and if someone asks me a question I'll probably be able to interact through there if I check it every once in a while. Uh, but I still for the most part check most of my video comments when I get the chance to every day or every couple day. When I post a video that's fresh, usually I watch it, uh, or usually I check up on it uh, every couple hours for like a day or two. Uh, and then any other videos in the past I'll review when I have the time, but I don't check them all the time. Uh, but that's why Twitter might come in handy if you have direct questions. Uh, but I do have a Twitter now, you can check for that. Number two, I have been experimenting with live streaming. If you saw yesterday, I was on for a bit trying to experiment with it. Uh, but that being said, I am working out all the kinks for it. I'm trying to get it to stream onto YouTube Live. That's where I'd like to. But I am having difficulties there for whatever reason. So that one might be a bit delayed. But I do have my Twitch TV one up and running. Uh, again, my internet is crap though, so it'll probably be at max. Maybe a 480 or a 360p stream. Uh, so if that's, if that's not for you, that's fine. I get it. But my internet's crap and I am working out the kinks, so I'm not sure when it'll be that mixed with my schedule. But I do have Twitch T I do have a Twitch TV account now. It's pick underscore six underscore touchdown. If you do want to sign up for that or do want to follow that. Uh, I'm not sure again when I'll be posting, but there is a Twitch and I am I have do have a Twitch account. And I will be uh, experimenting and figuring out more about streams soon enough. So those are the two quick updates. Uh, and well, that's it. See you later.